Ta-da! Wait, Christian's Quext. How you doing out there? Yedikshin Wen Wen. Good morning. Yedikshidisht. Good evening. I hope you're doing well. Well, it's uh, breakfast with Uncle. And let me tell you. Can you guess what I have? Do you know it? Do you love it? Do you need it? Hot cereal. Today is real good. I got some uh, fresh bananas, blueberries, frozen raspberries. And then I've got some cinnamon. And then I've got some hemp hearts and butthole blast, AKA ground flaxseed. And a Hershey squirt. Not peanut butter, like actual poo. I pooed in this, you know, because I want to keep the cycle of my chi strong, you know. I want to keep it going, you know, if, you know, if that's what I want to do. Just kidding. Peanut butter. Because I got a big day ahead. And I got a big bowl of cereal. Oh, jeez. I'm going to have to hit a restroom somewhere later. A couple of hours later. Just, pfft, oh, jeez. Lay down a yogurt cone. Anyways, so, what am I reading? Well, I'm reading Stoned, the This is by Joe Wood, Ron Wood's wife, and this is pretty good. It's fun. It's funny. It's candid photos of life on the road with the Rolling Stones from about 1970 to, like, about five years ago. 40 years. Oh, jeez. Real good. Boy, those guys knew how to party. Ooh, I can't believe they made it. So anyways, that's what I'm reading. And the weather. Let's get to the weather. Wow, it's beautiful out there. Oh my goodness gracious. It's like all the leaves are coming back on the trees and you know, the birds have moved on finally from my patio. They stopped shitting on my deck. Oh, Jesus. Little buggers. Now, uh, it's real beautiful out, it's clear, there's no wind, it's probably going to get really hot today, you know, like 16, 18 degrees Celsius, and you know, you're going to have that swatch factor, it'll be really high, like 7 out of 10, so get yourself some paper towel and make a muffler and just, you know, just put it down in the old mudslide canyon, so when you get all sweaty, you can just go and throw it at somebody at work, eh? Eh? That would be funny. <laughs> and as for the horoscope, jeez, whoa, it's a Gemini kind of day because it's two days in a row. It's been beautiful. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, Gemini, what are we going to do with you? So the twins, hey, Gemini? So the good one's got to fight the evil one to the death today. And that's going to be your chi for the rest of your life so whoever wins inside your head that's who you're gonna be so uh gemini you know i hope the the right one wins because you know then you won't be divided and going crazy all the time and you know get confident you know you can do this you got this you know the, the good side will win or the bad side will win whatever uncle doesn't care i don't whatever but um it's tuesday so get an auto ticket and then give uncle five percent and then uh what else treat yourself go for a walk you know get some exercise and you fart less and bug your co-workers and we're going into another lockdown so that means you know stay home stupid if you don't gotta do nothing okay you know, we're still in the middle of a pandemic. Bunch of yahoos out there acting like it's spring break in Mazatlan or whatever the hell those crazy shamats do. Anyways, Pisces, you take care. Go get a letter ticket and uh, change your socks and uh, have a quick shower. You know, love is in the air. It's springtime, eh? 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 So, uh... And don't take it so seriously, you know. When someone says, you know, your farts stink, that's okay. Because, you know, they probably do. So, like, don't, don't get offended. You know, that's just work on your balance and your chi and your positive reinforcement that you're popular. 
You're cool. People like you. Not uncool, but you know, you can hang out a little bit. So take care, cook jam and cook stipe, and remember, see you tomorrow for breakfast.